Hi, welcome to clickmyproject.com. This video will lead us to TAM, a tired authentication of multicast protocol for ad hoc networks. An ad hoc network is a type of temporary computer to computer connection. In ad hoc network, you can set up a wireless connection directly to another computer. The opponents are trying to manipulate the data. The host will use the situation of multicast traffic authentication of source and message integrity is the basic requirement tired authentication is used in multicast protocol multicast traffic employs the message authentication code that is mac to authenticate the message source advanced encryption standard that is aes used to cipher the file for the security purpose by the sender central authority that is ca sends the ciphered files to the users in ad hoc networks and the users retrieves the file by the aes algorithm and confirms the integrity of the file by mac first of all the sender selects a text file and then generate the mac by using mac key then append the mac and key of the mac to the data that the sender wants to transfer and using the aes key the file is encrypted then send the encrypted file to the central authority the central authority transfers the file to the receivers then the receiver one use the aes key to decrypt the file and get the mac key from the file also get the mac from the file then using the mac key the receiver one generates the mac to the received file finally compares the mac generated by the receiver and mac getting from the file if both mac is equal means the integrity of the file is proved else the integrity of the file is not proved next we are going to see the demo of tam initially we need to start the server here our server is central authority central authority is used to transfer the file between sender and receiver and central authority is used to reduce the overhead of the sender then we enter to the tired authentication process first first of all we need to select a file which is going to be transferred it must be a text file next we going to generate the message authentication code it is a random code used for checking integrity the message authentication code and message authentication code key is appended to the selected file next we are going to encode file by using advanced encryption standard technique the advanced encryption standard technique need 16 byte key for encryption then provide the individual ip address of the receivers and then save it for the appropriate receivers the there are two receivers and then the file is sent to the central authority the central authority sends the file to the receiver 1 the receiver one selects a file which is transferred this file is in the encrypted form then type the same 16 byte key which is used by the sender then only the file is decrypted
now the mac in the file is retrieved and the key used for mac is also retrieved then the receiver one checks the integrity of the file by using the mac key getting from the file <coughs> now the central authority sends the file to receiver 2 the receiver 2 selects a file which is transferred this file is in the encrypted form then type the same 16 byte key which is used by the sender then only the file is decrypted the mac in the file is now retrieved the key used for mac is also retrieved then the receiver 2 checks the integrity of the file by using the mac key getting from the file 